Hey folks, Bayou Golf, Beaver Creek, hole 13, par 5, 525. That's where I'm playing in that today. Par 5, got a uh, dog leg left, and we got some wind in our face. Good hit, very good hit. Okay, let's go see what we got. Well, I was, I was wondering if that wind was going to do anything to us, but... Uh, uh, might have kept it down a little bit, but that's about it. I'll tell you what, the sun's out and it's starting to get a little muggy. The Louisiana roux muggy. Oh yeah, baby. We're cooking now. All right. Oop. I'll tell you what, I gotta get me a new camera stand, folks. Uh. Y'all didn't catch it on the last one. What? Which? Which cat? Which camera stand? <laughs> Let's try that again. Take two. Which camera stands do you guys use? All suggestions would be appreciated. All right. Woo! This is nice. Nice and cool right here. See, normally, <laughs> normally that's where I would be teeing off, right there. But I'm playing it for what we call the uh, purple LSU over here, folks. Gold, purple, white, and then red. Today I'm playing the uh, golds. So, excuse me, I'm playing the purples. All right, let's get up here. Not a bad hit. We're in the fairway. All right, let's see here. Uh, this, like I said, this is a par five dog leg, dog leg left. And uh, y'all seen this before. It's got a little nasty double sand trap up there. But it's, uh, it's, it is a par five, so I thought I would show it to you again. Okay. Well, let me try to get this stand right here, folks. Hang on. Hang with me. Okay. Let's, let's uh, either down the middle or let's keep it on the right-hand side. Left-hand side is kind of dangerous. Let me uh, let me back you up a little bit more. All right, right there. Okay. Whew. Man, I tell you what, it is oven microwave oven muggy right now. All right. Go ball, go, 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 go. All right, kind of a low ball. Uh, probably had it too low in my takeaway, but it was down there with a little draw. Been working on that today. Been uh, trying to try to find my uh, my uh, uh, my elk. <laughs> what are we gonna call it? My, la my latitude and longitude for my angle. I think I've been too flat, and I've been trying to work it up. Right there, I probably came down, came into my angle a little bit too flat, but uh, it was uh, it was a good hit. Didn't, it didn't have the flight when I wanted, but uh, what, what's the old Rolling Stones? You don't always, you can't, you don't get always what you want. Absolutely. All right, here we are. All right. Now. I was hoping it would kind of keep keep in the middle because now we gotta we have to we have to navigate through those double sand traps. Let me get you some yardage here so I can uh, come on. Yep, this is gonna be the last day with this stand right here, folks. All right, let's see here. 13. It says it's on the front, and that says 107. Huh? I don't believe it. Okay, 107. All right, we'll go with it. All right, I've been catching it, been catching it really good, so I'm gonna use my auxiliary wedge. Like I said, we got some wind up there. It kind of changed, kind of from left to right right now. So maybe I can get it up there and it'll help me, help me push it if I need some push. All right. Comfort, confidence, contact. Good ball. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
<laughs> yeah, baby. Right under the flag. I'm telling you folks, you catch these balls where they're supposed to be caught. What? Let's see, how far was that? That was 107 with a sideways wind. And if it's true, it was right, it's right in front of the right in front of the flag. So let's see here. Ah, it's a little short. Celebrated a little bit too early. Well, still felt good. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can uh, see if we can get it up there, punch it up a little bit, punch it up just a little bit, and drop it in there. Let's see if we can't make it a birdie, or I mean, a possible birdie, or even a par. All right. That felt so good, I thought it was on. I thought it was on. All right, folks, we're doing a little chip in here. I'll, I just want to get it up a little bit, let it run. I walk in, got the toe, got the heel of the club up, okay? I'm gonna stay in my, stay in my angle, stay in my channel, and just put it and let it roll up, okay? This is one for you when you want to keep it kind of low. Ah, well, that was a little too hard, but it just stayed low, but it was, uh, oh my God, a little bit too hard. I haven't, haven't had to use those today. For, I think that might have been the first one, not sure. But that is the way you do it. Sh should have landed it right here. I landed it right here, and this, and this ground is, is hard. It doesn't have a lot of grass. Where I'm putting at right here has no grass. So we're just gonna see if, see if, we, uh, see if he'll take care of us. All right. All right. Good start, but bad finish. The chip shot is what hurt me, folks. Practice your chip shots. Like I said, you lift the heel up, you want a low runner, lift the heel up and bring it back. Might have used a little less club right then, but I did not hit my spot. My spot was further back, I hit it further up. Okay, by your golf, let me see if I can get you one more. <laughs> 